1966 season featured one of the great college football teams of all time. Where else but in Knoxville against Old Foe, Tennessee. Neyland Stadium was stuffed as usual, despite pouring rain, the kind of weather a swamp rat loved. Tennessee quarterback Dewey Warren was called that for the home folks. And he was a daring dandy who had the big orange in front of Bama 10 to nothing well into the fourth quarter. Then up stepped the snake. Kenny Stabler marched the tide down the field, ran to the one himself, and then stuck it in the end zone, followed by a two-point conversion pass from Stabler to Wayne Cook. 10 to eight, Tennessee. Time becoming precious. Bama ball, their own 25-yard line. 13 plays later, in one of Ken Stabler's greatest moments of engineering, Stabler then handling a low, skidding snap. Place kicker Steve Davis knocked it straight through. Alabama 11, Tennessee 10. But with what little time remained, Tennessee came storming back and then missed a chance to win with a field goal try from the three as time ran out. The Tide routed Nebraska 34-7 in the Sugar Bowl, but if you remember, 1966 was the year of the celebrated 10-10 tie between Michigan State and Notre Dame. Alabama finished third in the poll.